Good morning, my beautiful collective. I hope you have a wonderful day. Good morning. Oh, look, I found an extra pack of cigarettes. Okay. Okay. You can ring my bell, ring my bell, ring a ring a ring. What's going on today? What is the energy today? I'm feeling pretty ecstatic. I'm feeling pretty good. Got up a little early, had some shit to do, so get things and let things fall into place. As they shall. Spirit. What's the message today? What's the message today? Oh, I just burnt. That's a good sign, y'all. That's a good sign, y'all. Tell us a story. Tell us a story, Spirit. Mm. Wake them up. Well, what the fuck is that? Okay, some of y'all shit. Some are just gonna blurt out a bunch of shit, okay? You're gonna be finding out some shit. Some are gonna be blurting out some shit. What the hell? <coughs> the universe and your 11-year-old self. One, one, one. It's funny when I uh, sat down to start the reading, it was one, one, two, one. So, one, one, one. New beginnings. New, new everything, guys. Oh, shit. Did I not say one, one, two, one? And look, 21 here in reverse. Polish your mirror for perfect clarity. Come on. Wipe the sleep from your eyes. Wake up. Come on. Come on. Some of y'all, maybe get your glasses checked, right? When's the last time you had your eyes checked? Eddie just uses this for reading, y'all. If not, I, I'm, I'm, I'm tromboning. You know what I mean? I'm at that age. What can I say? What can I say? Play, have fun. Look at everything in a new light, right? Gray skies are gonna clear up. Put on a happy face. You might as well be happy, because well, well, who the fuck wants to be sad, right? Look at your shit in a different perspective. Look at everything in a different perspective. Look at it through the eyes of a child. And, of course, you know, get a little deep here. Y'all could still be doing the childhood healing, the traumas, the dramas, and all that beautiful shit, right? I like to find your inner child and kick its little ass. Get over it. Boom. Polish your mirror for perfect clarity. What's the future hold? It's like the crystal ball. Look into the future. What do you see? What do you see? What do you want to fucking see? That's how that shit works. You control your future. You control it. You control your future. I love it. I love it. A little deep. A little deep for this morning. That's okay, though. That's okay, though. Y'all think we're going to use the mermaid. You know what? Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Here we go. Kristen Court. Send me this lovely little deck, guys. And you know what I was going through it? The Lyrical Life Notes. Check this deck out. Um... There's only about five songs I didn't know. A lot of them I've sung in readings prior, so thank you, Kristen. What's the song for the day? Let's learn a new song for today, right? Spirit, give me the song. What's the song for the day? What's the song for the day? Such a beautiful day out, guys, but it's already humid as fuck. Oh. Give us a song, Spirit. Now, what the hell? Y'all, see how all this shit's just wanting to fly? So, some of y'all, I think shit's just gonna start happening fast, okay? I don't know what the fuck. 
Mind your own biscuits and life will be great. Okay, I don't know that one. I'm not, uh, Casey Musgraves. You can go your own way. Go your own way. Yeah. Do your thing, honey. Do what you want to do, yeah. Oh. You gave away the things you loved. And one of them was me. I had some dreams. There were clouds in my coffee. Clouds in my coffee. And you're so vain. You probably think this song is about you. You're so vain. I bet you think this song is about you. Don't you? Don't you? Ooh. There will be an answer, let it be. Oh, hell yeah. Everyone but the Mind Your Own Biscuits and Life Will Be Gravy. Casey Musgrave. Sorry, just not a country fan, really. I like the old country. Come on, that's what my dad listened to. So, you know, that's what I grew up with, 70s and 80s country. Well, obviously, you can go your own way because you're so fucking vain, you didn't realize what a good thing you had. There will be an answer. Let it be. Let go and let God. Whatever aspect it is in your life, if it's a love situation, there you go. Let go and let God, right? You can't control somebody. That shit don't work. You can't manipulate them. <laughs> I'll kill myself if you go. Don't leave. Don't leave. Okay. Anyone ever says that to you, you better bolt your ass out the fucking door as fast as you can. I don't, I don't give a shit. Run! Run like a motherfucker! Oh, sweet Jesus. There will be an answer. Let it be. Oh, and I'm thinking of Bridge Over Troubled Water. Like a bridge over troubled water, I will lay me down. Ooh, we got some oldies. I love that. Oh, I feel like I'm waiting for something that isn't going to happen. Ever since I met you, nobody else is worth thinking about it. But you're so vain. You probably think this song is about you. Yeah. Yeah, get out of this. I feel like I'm waiting for something that isn't going to happen. Because chances are, it's not. Move the fuck on. Next, get out there and meet somebody. Do something fun. Do something new. Do something exciting. What deck do we want to use, folks? What am I feeling for y'all today? I was thinking the Mermaid Tarot deck. I like this energy, guys. Getting over shit, right? Build a bridge. Get over that shit. Oh, Lord. Love can build a bridge. Between your heart and mine. Oh, the judge. What the fuck? What the fuck? Y'all, I think Winona is underrated, okay? I mean, that, that girl can sing. She had a voice, right? She had a voice. She has a voice. I don't know. I haven't heard anything from her in a while. I'll have to look her up online. No one else on earth was ever worth it. Yeah. The spirit, what's in the air? The hangman in reverse. Someone stuck. Someone stuck nine of cups in reverse. They ain't chasing their dreams. Dream, man. Dream big. I dreamed a dream in time gone by. 
when hope was high and life worth living. I dreamed that love would never die. I dreamed that God would be forgiving. Oh, my Lord. Dramatic over love. Oh, sweet Jesus. Y'all know that bitch dies, right? What the fuck? She let a man fuck up her life, turns her into a fucking whore. She gives up her child and she dies. And the bitch had to cut her fucking hair to boot. What the hell? Life ain't that fucking tragic, y'all. Okay. I don't care what the fuck you want. There ain't no D or P that that's fucking, uh, that, that's that fucking good. Okay. Mm-mm. Uh-uh, look at that. Where's the happiness at? Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Well, what'd you do to piss her ass off if she's gone? Okay, ask your ass that question. Collective, is that your energy or someone you're dealing with? Did we cut this deck? Spirit, put that sun card back in there. Let's bring that sun card out in the in the other direction. Okay, okay. Y'all, I gotta say, with the elemental readings, yesterday I was just, like, meditating. I got out and tried to get a little bit of sun and, and uh, charge my crystals up. Of course, the, so by the time I got out there, the clouds started coming in, so I didn't get as much time as I wanted. You know, ending of, of, of cycles, guys. New coming in. You know, when, when you learn to release, when things, you know, the death card is basically... Uh, ending something for something new to begin. You know, you got to clear the space to allow new in. Be optimistic. Be optimistic. Yeah, you know, go back to your 11-year-old self. Be happy. Be, be uh, you know, in awe of things. Remember when you thought anything was fucking possible? When was the last time you actually, like, played pretend? Go out and make a mud pie or some shit. You know what I mean? Go have fun. The devil in reverse, two of wands in reverse, queen of pentacles in reverse. I see a release here. You know, the devil is anything we do in excess that isn't always to our better good. Uh, especially if it keeps you stuck and stagnant. What you waiting, what you waiting, what you waiting, what you waiting, what you waiting for? I can't wait to go back to Tokyo. What is it? That Gwen Stefani song, right? What the fuck you waiting for? Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Your stability, right? Your your money. Your 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 you're making every excuse as to why you can't, which is bullshit. Y'all, anything is possible. Ingenuity. Ingenuity. Don't let anything restrict you. You know, at any given point in time, you have the resources you need to accomplish what you need to accomplish at that moment. <sighs> you know, it's like the magician card, right? No, you might not be able to go buy what you need, but can you look around and use what you already have to get you going? Maybe some of this this uh, this devil energy that you need to release from is your uh, is your limiting beliefs, right? Of why you can't do sit, why you can't do this. Oh, I can't go there. I can't do that. Oh, I can't do this because you're just so used to maybe people telling you that you can't, or maybe you just telling yourself that you can't. Who the hell says you can't? I'm looking at this bitch with a beautiful fucking wig on, right? She's in reverse. Shit. Y'all don't think if I went bald, I wouldn't be wearing some kind of wig or some shit? Fuck y'all, I'd be changing that shit up every fucking day. You think I'd give a shit? You think I'd give a shit? I'd be like, fuck y'all, I want to be a redhead today. Fuck y'all. Do what you want to do. It's your thing. Do what you want to do, yeah. Three of Wands, it's your thing. Do what you want to do. Oh, fucking A. Thank you, spirit. Thank you, spirit. Look at that. Three of Wands. 
What's the star card? Do what you want to do. Be a star in your own fucking life. Oh my God. So many people take supporting roles in their fucking life because they give everyone else the starring role. Right? Why are you going to play uh, a supporting role in your fucking life? It's your lifetime movie for fuck's sake. Turn that shit into an Academy Award winning, I don't know, rom-com. Or maybe when shit gets a little dramatic, you're able to do the, the winning uh, scene. You know what I mean? Flip that switch up. It ain't all one way. It, 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 yeah, it's not all or nothing. It can't just be all sadness. Now, you know, it can't be all happy because you have to have the sadness to remind you. You know what I mean? But you can find a happy fucking middle. Because I'm seeing the King of Pentacles here in reverse. With this Eight of Swords. Same old story. Same old story. Boy meets girl. Girl meets boy. They can't make it work because they're both in shitty relationships or they both have fucking issues they need to deal with because no one can make a decision. So they're trapped. This story's getting old, though. You know what I mean? There's plenty of people who can give you what you want. Get out there and meet them, okay? Don't be barking up a tree that you know you ain't gonna be able to climb any fucking way. Queen of Swords, see the truth. Learn to see what them towers are. Come on, for fuck's sake. You know what I mean? Quit putting yourself in these positions where you have to turn into a bitch. You know, there are nice people out there who you can be nice and is gonna treat you good and you're not gonna ever have to get grouchy with them. You're never going to have to, to argue with them. You have to believe there are people out there, okay? If y'all are watching my channel, there you go. Right? There are people who you can actually work with and build with and create with. In friendships, in lovers, in, in partnerships, in whatever form you need to work with them. Not everybody should, should be... Uh, uh, a sparring partner. You know what I mean? Change it up. Some people are so used to that energy that if they meet people that aren't like combative or want to argue or they have a reason to bitch, they just don't know how to fucking handle it, right? They gotta have drama one way, shape, or... Yes, thank you, spirit. Look at this. Yeah, as soon as you release from that energy, the sun card and the nine of cups, happiness and options, wish fulfillment, for fuck's sake. I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna shed no tears. And there ain't gonna be no tears shed until you get down on one knee and propose to me. And it's happily ever after because you two can work together. You two can fucking work together and build together and create together. This is someone that wants to be with you. This is someone that chooses to be with you. This is someone you choose to be with. This is someone you want to be with. We're not waiting around for people that can't bring us shit. If you can't step up to the plate, someone will. You know what? Enjoy being single for fuck's sake, you know? If you can't, if you can't be happy with yourself... If you can't be happy with your own damn self, you you think someone gonna tolerate your ass? I mean, think about it, y'all. You know, when you're by yourself and you kind of you know, deal with your shit, if you're a messy person, then you're the only one in the house, then you're like, oh shit, I'm a messy fucking person, <laughs> right? Or if you're a clean freak and then you look around and you're like, well, hell, it don't even look like anybody's fucking lived here, right? So you're like, well, what the fuck? What do I do? Maybe during that alone time, you find yourself, you go out and you have fun. I'm all about dating, you guys. Get out there and meet people. It can be casual. Have fun. You are exactly where you're supposed to be on this journey. I do believe, guys, happy days are here again. Happiness is. As soon as you realize what the hell you want, and you make the decisions that you don't put yourself in your own fucking restrictions, you don't give to people, places, or things that can't reciprocate, right? It is what it is. If you can't give to me what I need, then I'm going to go elsewhere. No drama there, right? I mean, how long you gonna wait around for somebody to make a fucking decision before you say, you know what, fuck you and fuck this. Fuck you and fuck this. 
Be the star of your life. Okay, do the healing work that you need to do. Realize realize where your hang-ups are. Realize where you could do better. And don't go do better. Okay. There are so many good single people out there. But you know what? None of us seem to meet each other. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? And a lot of it, I do blame these people that aren't single, that try to get themselves out there in the dating world. You know what I mean? They want to act like they're single. They want to put themselves in that mix. But at the end of the day, they know they can't come. It's never going to go any further than what it is, right? Now, it's all good to have sex. Y'all, there is nothing wrong with casual sex, okay? But, you know, if you're married, no, your only sex is with your partner. I do believe that. That's the value you took in front of God. You start stepping outside of that, and that, that that's your uh, dealings with the big guy. Uh, come on, y'all. And I don't give a shit. That's my beliefs. That's how it goes. Single people. Meeting other single people. Right? The ones who are uh, open to actually creating and, and growing together with somebody. You know what I mean? But we get a lot of these jokers and fools that want to play around in the single world and not take care of the responsibilities that they got. And you know what? It is what it is. What are you going to do? If you get into a situation like that, you can't expect to build with this person when they're supposed to be building with someone else. We got to shift our focus, course correction, and find the singles. Are you happy with yourself? If you had to live with yourself. Now, come on, y'all. And you all know this to be true. Now, if you're a messy person and you're by yourself, you can't blame someone else for your messy-ass house, can you? Nope. A clean freak? If you look around your house and it looks like no one's even lived there? <coughs> now, cleanliness is next to godliness, but, you know... Maybe you need to go out and learn to live a little bit, right? Create some life in those rooms. Anyone with an animal knows there's about as bad as a fucking kid. You know, I got to run the sweeper at least every other day between cat and dog hair. I, that's just, you know, that's just the way it goes. Nice, relaxed energy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Yeah, King of Swords in reverse with the Ace of Pentacles and the Two of Cups in reverse. Some of y'all, this could be a, a situation where you have removed from somebody. And you know, the King of Swords there could be a father type figure. So some of you with uh, your baby daddies. Um, money. Money. Money changes everything. So for some of you, don't let money be the reason why there's conflict with you and another person. Don't let money be the reason. Don't let money. It ain't worth it at the end of the day. Money comes and goes like the energy of life. Have it one day, you can lose it the next. I want to get another song. I wanted to get another song. Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? Where the fuck did I put it at, y'all? Well, sweet mother loving Jesus. Sweet mother loving. They don't want another song, apparently. Apparently. Where the hell did that dad go? What the hell? 
What the hell? Okay, y'all. You're gonna misplace something. Think about it. You can go your own way. You can go your own way. You sure fucking can. Peace, love, and light. Peace, love, and light.